before we actually get into it, I would love to see you two get down in the ring. I would love to see how you two fight. Because here's what's funny about this, Rex. Is my boy, like the guy I met that uh, is going to be joining us today. I shit you not, I thought I was fighting Amir the other day. When I met him, I thought I was fighting myself. Well, no, here's, here's the funny thing. He reminds me, like, if you were to fight this guy, you're going to realize he fights a lot like I used to. Bef like, before I started fighting uh, you guys more consistently and stuff like that, my early time fighting, like, uh, when I first started fighting, I, probably about a month or so after, this guy fights just like I do during, like, my second month into fight night. Uh, and it's fucking hysterical. I would love to see which one of y'all would come out on top, actually. Because... Look, look, you beat me. You've beat me, though. Here's that, that's the thing, though, is you beat me. That's what makes this... That's what makes this intriguing. Is... Like, my boy, he's good. Yeah, he's good. I'll give you. But then again, though, you're top six. Whether you're top five or six, like, you are top six on the focus. He's not up there yet. You've already made a name for yourself. Hell, you used to... Uh, you used to fight Chevy. Come on now. Chevy's pretty tough. So you know what it's like to fight a good opponent. This guy, he's faced me. Otherwise, he hasn't had a good opponent yet. So that is like, if you think about it, it balances itself out. So y'all should really go and give it a go at each other. I mean... Well, here's the thing. In every Fight Night video, I've dropped down the, uh... I would shortly drop in the uh, description the link to the server. So anyone could join. And I recommend that you might start doing the same. I could send you a link. So you could uh, start dropping it. Just to help uh, spread it around so more people could come in. But as far as I'm concerned, all things considered... One of y'all can start up the lobby, and just re I'll relay the code to the other person. So are you ready for a uh, for a fight night then, A or uh, Cap? You ready to get them hands going? You ready to get that adrenaline going? All right. So when you're ready. Oh yeah, no, no. When you're ready, when you're ready, let me know, and then uh, go to join room. Yeah. Look, one of the biggest things is learning control. Once you learn control, You talking about uh, Bo or Kevin Nash? No, wait, no, it's not Kevin Nash. This isn't WWE. I need to stop calling him Kevin Nash. It's Bobby Nash. Yeah, I I know who you're talking about. Well, here's something you gotta go and remember too. And this happens to every fighter, and I do mean every fighter. Once they start taking and getting better at the game, they go and fall for one big, massive problem. I've fell in this trap. I'm pretty sure Rexy has fell in this trap. You'll get cocky. You will think you're tough shit. And once you start thinking that, you're going to get arrogant. And that's a trap a lot of fighters get into. Whether they know about it or not, they'll go and get in that, uh, I'm really good state think they can't get beat and then it takes a real good fighter like uh like one of the people me and Rexy knows like uh his name's Spartan oh man he he no, he's good that man he he's he's horrifying like that man put me in my place when I thought I was good hell no he beat me black and blue he did it without even breaking a sweat all right so the code would be yeah, give, give me a, what's the code, Rex? 704042. 
Yeah, I know, right? Not enough clicking in that one. No, you guys are both real good fighters. Like, both of you guys are impressive. Downright impressive. Like, I have no doubt this will be an interesting fight because both y'all are quick, high-speed fighters. Both y'all are pretty... Yeah, you good. Like, both y'all are quick fighters, and that's what's going to make it uh, interesting. However, like I said, he fights a lot like I used to. So, as, like, as far as I'm concerned, if I was to put down a bet, if I'm a betting man and I'm not putting in... Like, if I'm going to be 100 unbiased. Oh, that's because he uh, said he'll be right back. Yeah, he's, he's back, yeah. You just look over and he's just crawling around on the ground, yeah. <laughs> but, yeah, no, what? It really does. Um, do you have any preference to uh, Rena, Rexy, or are you good? No, he, he don't. He don't care. No, if I was a betting man, because since, uh, I'm, I'm going to go and put it like this. Since Rexy has moved up and he's been uh, on this creed, he's pretty much been a protege. I've been teaching him, getting him better. I've been getting him and uh, training him. You, now since uh, you now, <laughs> now that uh, you are, f uh, now that we've met, I don't mind training you. So since both y'all are like a protege, my, uh, my, uh, Oh yeah, oh yeah, that that's why I find it uh like his movements are good. Aces or caps movements. Yeah, Re Rexy's quick. Rexy's quick. Cuz here's the thing. This is where I knew this would be an interesting fight. Rexy's biggest problem is the duck and weave. If you could keep out of his uh line of fire, you got that. You could beat him easy. Your combos, your speed can match up if you keep out of his range. Rexy, though, I know for sure is the much faster opponent. That's that's what I'm saying. That's what I'm saying. You two would make a great thing, like a great opponent for each other, since you guys really do correspond. Your biggest weakness, Rexy, is moving, and this guy's great with that. On the flip side, though, you're much quicker. And so it makes it like that's what I'm saying. Well, that's because you need to learn to start ducking and weaving too, right? Like, hot damn. I'm pretty sure I told you that last week too. Because here's what I know is I know once Rexy catches you in that stagger, you better hope to get out of that stagger as quick as you can. Because once he catches you, once he catches you, hot damn. He, he's a flurry fighter. He's quick on his hands, but he needs to... I've been trying to teach him and trying to get him looser. I was trying to get him into trying to fight more freely. And trying to get into combos and stuff. Because flurry fighting is nice, but combos can really devastate something over flurry fighting. Like I said, both y'all have your ups and downs. No, with how? So with how? So. Yeah, because Rex is saying that whenever someone moves, it throws them off. Shit like that. Like, he can't catch up with that. Like, uh, Rexy is used to standing and banging with people. So when your movements really do, uh, mess him up. Now, with how Fight Nights work, uh, Cap, is they, uh... With how fight nights work, is uh you have you guys have an optional uh warm up fight. After that is the best two out of three until you get up to the final fight or the final two competitors. Once you get there, it's gonna be the best three out of five.
Oh. There's one fight. You got one, maybe two more. Was that the practice round for y'all or no? Well, did you want a practice round, Rexy? Or... All right. That's the all practice round. You all now have a... Uh, it's going to be best two out of three now. Yeah, like I said. Oh, jeez. Like I said, Rexy's biggest problem is ducking and weaving. However, I know for sure Rexy can outpatch you and speak. His punching and power is guaranteed much better than yours. Oh, he's such a fast, by the way, Rex. He, he'll give you that. He's giving you props for you. You see, that's why I respect about both y'all, is y'all don't know anything and you guys don't hear each other. Like, this is what I'm respecting. Oh, you did? You see, back to both of y'all, it's neither one of y'all can hear the other one. You guys don't know what y'all saying about each other. And you guys are being such good sports and you guys won't stop complimenting each other. It's so much respect despite not knowing what the other one's doing. Oh yeah, he treats everybody like the speed bag. Hell yes, he does. Now, I used to fight just like Rexy did. It's just, I would be a lot more aggressive. I'm much quicker than that. However, by fighting faster, it also consumes more stamina. I'm cool with using combos. Alright, so how's the match going? How, what are we looking like? <laughs> so you beat him a full round this time now. Or you just knock him down once. Oh man. Like I said, Rexy's really good with speed and punching power. That's why you gotta utilize good defense and your uh, movement on him. Once you could utilize both of those, it'll help train both of you. Because I'm thinking if you guys play together more often and fight more often, what will likely come down is Rexy will learn to start using combos and to uh, break away from his flurry methods. And it will help you learn better defense and movement. You see what I'm saying? Like I said, you guys really are an ideal matchup for each other. Oh yeah, he's strong, but he's cocky though. His biggest... Well, here's the thing about Apollo. He could take hits, but if you're a... Uh... Like what Tough does, if I'm not mistaken, it makes it harder to get staggered. But if you're strong, that don't mean jack shit nothing. He will stagger you much quicker. So it pretty much comes down to where you both are cocky. The only difference is, is that you guys have no pros. You. Neither one of you gets a uh, b benefit now. Because uh, Apollo and his... Rex is tough, but he doesn't play online as much. He hasn't gotten used to online yet. He's used to fighting bots. Yeah, no. And Fight Night, the way we do things is we don't have, we don't judge you for your style of fighting. We don't care about that. Because a true fighter, it don't matter. Cheese the game. We'll learn out how to go and outdo your cheese and we'll beat your ass for doing it. Yeah, he, he, I told you he's good. He's a lot like I used to be. Oh, 
Oh yeah, that. Why do you think I keep trying to tell you to break away from flurries? Getting into the uh, swarm fighter, trying to get into uh, ducking and weaving is a lot better. One more fight between you guys. It sounds like Cap got the first win. You know what? Actually, Victor is one of the big boys, though. I mean, Victor's not too bad, but his OP stats left me to not appreciate the character. Because I didn't want somebody to just give me the upper hand just because they're character wise. So I never really got into Victor. He's always been OP as shit on PS4. I mean, I've beaten Victor with Apollo. I believe it. The ability to duck and weave can come in handy real quickly. Like being... Oh no, he, he's a killer. Everyone in fight night. Oh, he's cool. He just wants that belt. He has that eye. He, he hasn't had the belt. Like, like, here's the thing. Everyone in Fight Night, we give everything we have because this belt, it may be metaphorical, but that... It, it seems a real little ridiculous, but I mean, when you start fighting against some of the, like, once you start getting used to it, You'll see what uh, we mean by we want that belt. Now, win or lose. The, I'm, I'm going to say the winner of... Uh, this set, like wh whoever wins this set, will get a chance to take a breather. The loser. Oh yeah, between fight, uh, between the sets, if you need a breather, I don't give a shit. Well, here's the thing, Rex. That's why I told you not to focus on Flurry, is because I know against someone who's good with like movements and defense, you'll wear yourself out unnecessarily trying to pressure. Like that's the general idea is trying to go and find a way to uh, pace yourself and trying to learn the best methods to beat those type of fighting styles. That's why nobody in Fight Night gives a shit what you use or how you use it because there's a way to cancel everything. There is no style of fighting, no method that can't be like uh, that can't have its uh, down like uh, its counterpart. Flurry fighters, they're pretty easy to defend against. Against traditional fighters, damn! I thought I came close to my old score. My board glitched. <laughs> My board is glitched out on the flurry bag. It's saying I got 316 and it knocked me down a rank. But in my uh, friend's chat though, it's saying I got a higher score than what I have. My, the, the game, like, you'll see what I mean. You'll see what I mean on us. Uh, you'll see what I mean when I, uh, when you look at the video. Uh, Ivan Drago? I thought he was playing as Victor. He, uh... Like I, like I said, like I said, there's a way to cancel that. Alright, uh, he has, uh, requested that you steer away from, uh, Victor. Because of his OP power.
I'm just relaying the message. I still find that funny. How did I glitch out the board to say the wrong thing, bro? Maybe going back to menu. Like... No, it's just funny to see that it's saying an old, my old score for the flurry dummy instead of uh, my current one. It just, it threw me back. Yeah, it's saying that I'm down it here now. Huh. Remember saying to this? Ah, uh, man, you should know there's no perfect stagger. Man, I know what you need, Rexy, to get back into the groove and get back into your old self. Man, you need to fight, like, Chevy or one of the big boys again. That is odd. The board is completely glitched. I just reset board, and it's still saying I got... 663 on my friends and self. If I go global though, it says I went and deranked. Yeah, it's best two wins of three fights entirely. Y'all are on, yeah, y'all are on your last one. This is the tiebreaker here. The winner takes the gold here in the championship. I'll be taking the loser and I'll be fighting the loser. Yeah, how does the game glitch like this? This is actually annoying the shit out of me. Okay, that that is going to piss me off seeing the wrong number. I know I did better than that. I should not be ranked three. I should be ranked number one. Yeah, yeah that definitely got to be checked up. I'm definitely going to fix that. Maybe I need to go on and reset my headset as well. Maybe I don't know, but... Seeing the wrong score up there, my old score up there, it makes me look bad. Oh well, I mean... I, I told you. Oh yeah, it, it just takes a little bit of know-how and a little bit of figuring out who works and uh, how it works. Once you figure out that out, it, it's pretty simple work. Maybe I'm, I'm just... Oh yeah, he sends his regards. GG, man. So it looks... So it looks like I'm gonna be taken... Now... With how this is going to go, okay, well, glitched. Yeah, what is with that? Yo, Rexy, do me a favor. Can you go up to the flurry dummy and tell me what the global leaderboard says? The, f the flurry, the bag. Who's rank one? So it did reset my score. It took my score away from me. Because so West nine nine. What score did he have? There, there should be no way I'm three sixteen. I've showed you in a screenshot where my score is literally doubled this. Yeah, that's not right. You see, that annoys the shit out of me because my th my 663 is not up there. But if I go to my friends only, though, like if I was to go to friends and self, it registers that number. But globally, it's not up there. Well, it looks like I'm going to just have to go and hit this bag even harder and I had to just take my score back then. Yeah, I'll take, uh, if you want to take a moment to breathe, that's fine, too. Uh, 
All right, so this is how. So this is how it's gonna go. So since um, since Cap took and uh, took you down, Rex, I'll take you on, and then assuming I win anyways, which I highly doubt I won't. You know, I, I highly doubt I lose here. I will be taken, and uh, the winner of this fight will come back. So you get a redemption chance to come back and to uh, win. So I'm going to, uh, it is 940. And then, then 753. But the winner of this bout would go and send us up to the championship, and then the champion, well, then the two, uh, then uh, Cap will be, it'll be, It'd be nine four zero seven five three. Yeah, no, it'd pretty much go like that. It's pretty much because I don't want to be like, oh well, I'm champ. I get the no. Fuck that. I'm champ. I'm beating both of you. Fuck that. Look, I mean, I I've held the belt for so long doing only single fights. It's been a minute since I've had to go and fight through multiple opponents. I want to go and fight through multiple opponents like uh, we used to. It's been so long since there's been a two, three person fight night, so. Yeah, you, you've, you've done it so long. Yeah, I, I remember when I was breaking my old habit of trying to flurry and stuff. Oh yeah, you is the idea of trying to remember the new fight that the new creed has different abilities, the ability to walk and whatnot. You want your warm up or do you need one? Um you bitch you had a warm up, shut up. Let's go. <laughs> you want Hey. Hey, look, you gonna go on uh, work my arms are just fun doing this. Don't think I, I love going high speeds like this. Hey, don't forget how look, I think you forget how many hits I can do in a second now. So since I've hit up that gym, I'm much quicker. Owie. Well, yeah, you're welcome. And then you fucking get your ass but No, there's two methods that's good for fighting players like Rexy. Ah, uh, Cap. Having really good defense and uh, mo like mobility will cancel that out. Or oh, you gonna match him in uh or you match him in speed. It seems like that's the case, but I mean it's pretty easy to do if you know what you're doing. You also gotta be willing to go and target multiple body parts at the same time. I mean that's true. Well, that's very true that it's easy to hit someone into Like, it's easy to throw someone into a stagger and to hold them there. But almost every stagger has the same uh, location. Also, it now registers that it knocks down four instead of three. I think they might have did, like, a passive update, and that might be why the board's bugged. They call him the showstopper now. Look, I don't know why they fucking changed his name from Rhino anyways. Like, that's by far the stupidest change they've... Who knows, but fucking it's one of the stupidest names. The showstopper. Oh, yeah. Oh, no, Tommy Gunn was the newest character. They dropped him a... They dropped him late last year. They dropped him a part of the science and, uh... It was something science or science something update. 
However, they also said that that's going to be the last big update for a minute as they got something, quote, quote, in secret they're working on for us. I hope it's Mickey, personally. I'm hoping that Mickey joins the game, if I'm honest. I mean, Mike Tyson was in, uh, Mike Tyson was in Rocky Balboa. So, I mean, he didn't fight, but he was definitely there. You know how many people would choose Mike Tyson? You know how many people would disgrace Mike Tyson trying to play as Mike Tyson and lose? <laughs> Fucking Mike Tyson's... <laughs> Paid to win, Mike Tyson, yep. One, oh, jeez. Look, we ain't talking about no prison rape, Mike Tyson, here, okay? I'm kind of tempted to see how it goes if I was to go and try to retail Chevy your ass. I'm tempted to try to fight like Chevy against you and see how well that works. Never mind. Never mind. Uh, well, so far it's uh, one, me, zero, him, and he don't look like he's doing too hard. Oh shit. Told you, Greendale Chevy your ass. I Chevy your ass. <laughs> Two, three. Hell yeah, because I'm that quick. I'm that quick, I tapped you on the side of your cheek. Owie. Oh, I forgot, I got knocked down already. Shit, I thought I was running this flawlessly so far. Oh yeah. Now every fight night, it's every fight night's on video. From now on, every fight night, since I'll be hosting it, will be on video. Well, Rexy, that was good, man. Y you were quick, but you gotta remember to use defense and to duck and weave more. You really do. You got to break your habit. Start fighting. Break your habit, damn it! I'm telling you, you break your habit, you'll start winning. You break that habit, you'll start getting better. All right, when you're ready, uh, Cap. Rexy says GG's. I think he wants you to beat me. I think he's a uh, champ to get dethroned. He's like, this man's held this belt for almost over a month now. This man needs to lose. He. All right, the code is 218. Yep. Oh no, you good. I, I mean, shit, I just sit in the lobby. I'm definitely getting annoyed that that bug is there. I am getting annoyed that my name is down that low. I really will put my earbuds in after this and I'm going to hit this bag until I beat that. 218. 269. Or 265, my apologies. So it'll be 218265. This one's gonna be the best three out of five. Championship matches are bigger fights since it's for the belt. And so it pushes the champion and the push the last players the extra mile to go and win. Oh no, anything goes. Every, every, every fight night, there's no restrictions on uh, fight styles. There's no restrictions on characters. You fight in any manner you deem fit. You fight the way you think will work for you. If you think it will work, like let's say for instance, if uh, I'm a flurry fighter, if you want to sit down and 
to avoid any block. If that's what if that's what you think will work, you do what you think will work. Here. Hold on. I'm hold on. I'm kinda curious now. Here, let me see what I can do. Maybe it, it's it, it counters like part of them. <laughs> oh yeah, you just you just gotta have enough uh, momentum to be able to. Okay, well shit, I, I'm. Oh shit. Eh, who knows? It works. It's just it's being a bitch right now. <laughs> it's just laughing. Well, yeah, I gotta be Rocky Balboa, and I gotta be wearing the championship gold. <laughs> oh no! Oh, oh, you talk. Oh, you wanna wear the glow fit? Okay, okay, you wanna wear the glow fit? Oh, you wanna glow? We're gonna go and glow this house out. And any anywhere you want, any you wanna go? Let's go to Philly. Fuck yeah, Watch Tim works too. Watch Tim works too. I like the arena. Right there, that works. Hell yeah, that's a big uh, audience. <laughs> You see, Fight Nights get real fun because there's a few things a lot of people need to remember about Fight Night. It's not just about winning or losing. Yeah, it's nice to say that you're the champ, 100%. It is nice to walk around, hey, I'm champ. It's also one of the best feelings to be like, I beat everyone else. Even if you lose, hell yeah, that, that, it shows you had enough in the tank to go that distance. However, one of the best parts about Fight Night is being able to go against and losing against the best. At least then you get to say you put everything on the table, nothing left out. So you really get to say you went and had the best fight of your entire damn VR career. Is the best feeling. Oh, you got. Oh, you gonna. Oh, you gonna flex too. And his opponent, weighing in at an even 202 pounds, he is the reigning champion of the world, the Italian stallion, Rocky Balboa. You know, fun fact, he actually did weigh 202 pounds in Rocky 3. <laughs> no homo, man, but I love you too. Oh, trust me, it won't take me more than 10 minutes to win. You could quote that. Like I said, tell me it wasn't like fighting me back then. Tell me it's not like you weren't fighting me, just a lot less experienced. I was not joking when I said this guy fights just like I do. I'm trying to keep you out of stagger at the moment because I don't need to hold you there. It's kind of one of those cocky things. Oh yeah, I feel it. You see, some of the biggest problems for your uh, cap is uh, me and Rexy, we have faced some of the toughest opponents that this game has ever offered. Where so far, your best uh, opponent so far has been the two of us. Balboa drives a hard punch right through his opponent. Like, uh, one of the best opponents I've ever faced. Uh, you've heard the name because we keep talking about him and I keep mentioning him. His name's uh, Greendale, actually. Greendale is an impressive fighter because he's the, like, uh, what I'm doing to you right now is the style of which he fights people. There it is. There it is. Like, what I'm doing is a Greendale Chevy uh, level thing. Like, I've pretty much altered what he does, like his fighting style. I've altered that more toward a... 
to my physical ability. And I'm fighting you like him right now. That boy Spartan, he's much more defensive and oh, he's good too. He's quick. Balboa slams hard into his opponent. So what's going on is like uh, when you're covering like right here. What I'm doing is I'm actually going a lot more for hooks and I'm actually going for your side, not your front. That's why I'm able to get you. Is to keep uh, focusing on the straights and stuff. Isn't bad. But you gotta go and remember when to uh... You gotta remember when to fight uh, with certain things. When to cover certain things. If you notice your opponent likes going for the body more, cover the body more. Try to get in your opponent's head. Balboa delivering an absolutely devastating blow to his opponent. I'm gonna pay for trying to do this. Make me a sandwich, bitch. Owie. I'm gonna pay for doing this. I really am. I'm going to backhand you down. Owie. Sit down. I'm so sorry. I had to do it at least once. It is one of the most satisfying ideas to just backhand somebody. Yeah, I used to feel that all the time. I used to feel that. Once you start... Once you start upping your stamina and your endurance, you won't feel it no more. Like, right now, like, as we're fighting, you're breathing a lot heavier than I am. Me, you barely hear it. You might hear me inhale and in very lightly. Shit, I fought him too. I was... I fought him too. Best two out of three, he didn't. I had one round less because I put him down quick and easy. I also went high speed fighting on him, too. One, two, three. Or, I'm not the best. I ain't the best. Not yet. I like saying I'm the best. Hey, you knocked me down once, legit. The other time, well, actually, you knocked me down legit both. But you gotta remember, I was too hell bent on bitch macking your ass down. <laughs> Nicely done. You got two more rounds of this. I'm trying to put you down quickly. I'm trying to save you all that. Is that. Oh, shit. I need a. Uh, wham. You know what? Actually, I'm gonna just go down my line. I play as OG fighters. All right, no worries, Rex. Oh, you'll see the, uh, yeah, no. You know what? You think you can win? You think I must break you? That's what I think. All right, yeah, no worries. I'll probably premiere this around uh, regular fight night time, so. Man, I'll whip your ass. We all know which draw we all know which Drago is the better Drago anyways. You will lose. I must break you. I think you're all natural. I'm pretty sure Victor's all natural. I think Ivan's the drug uh, the drug you here. But then again, back then, steroids and drugs like that wasn't really a problem. Back then it didn't matter. That's why so many people used it. Uh, this is Russia. <laughs> no, now, now you see why I picked it. I fucking had to pick Russia for this bitch. <laughs> I wish they brought in more Rocky-oriented maps. Oh shit, there we go. I had to readjust my, uh, height. Alright, you ready? I will break you. That's a solid blow. There's the door. There's the door. I'll abandon you like my mother abandoned you. You will be abandoned by your father like your mother abandoned us. You already are. That's why I had to throw the fucking towel in. 
You lost to him too. You lost to him too. You lost to a you lost to an Adonis. Adonis is shit. Adonis is shit. Exactly. I beat the better fighter. You fucking lost to a bitch boy, Adonis. Yeah, well fuck it, are you are you Are you talking to me? Are you disrespecting your puppy? Are you disrespecting puppy? Are you Are you disrespecting puppy? Are you disrespecting puppy? Learn your place, bitch! <laughs> and fuck you! See, this is how you break someone. This is how you win. Because they can't breathe if I can. I'm too busy trying to laugh my ass off. I've done that to somebody too, where I beat them because I couldn't, I wouldn't stop making them laugh. While we were fighting, it was funny. I will, I will, I will, I will, I will bed you, wed you like your wife. Not shit, you don't. <laughs> Actually, we were together until you came along, you know. <laughs> I will break you. Oh, oh my, oh my Moscow, my Moscow. Oh. Oh shit. I never. I went the distance. You didn't do shit, did you? I faced the champ. You got your ass handed to you. You would have been champ. I. You were face of Russia too. You still lost like bitch too. You weak. You s sit up. One, you slow. Two. I'm old. Don't ask. I'm old. Oh boo hoo. Oh yeah, well. Fuck you. I'm tired of you and your bullshit. A nice That's cause I am I'm not sure I nigga. Don't you dare fuck with me boy. Ow. Get to the chopper. Get to the chopper. You know anyone who ever watches this is gonna watch us like what the fuck's going on at this point? No one's even gonna give a shit about the fight. No one even gives a shit about the fight no more, let's be honest. It's serious championship fight and all people hear us. Ah. Yeah, I'll take that, son. Ah. 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 I wasn't doing nothing. Drago, lands a good hit. <laughs> I'm tired of you. Trying to put on a show? I mean, we can. We're just blocking every fucking attack we throw at each other. With some good shots. Bitch, bitch, bitch. That's why you still float. A perfect hit from Drago. What? You mad because you know black man? Is that what you say? Your sister was gay way beforehand. Well, yeah, of course, buddy. Well, yeah, I would have too. They're both fucking hot. <laughs> you know what? No, you leave. You leave. You leave. I mean, have you not seen? I mean, she's technically step. She's step, but like, I may have had an affair with your mother, anyways. 
It really don't matter. Let, let's just, let's just act like that never was said. That's. You know what? That I go to prison beating your ass. You won't. I'm gonna give you a concussion. You ain't gonna have nothing. Nothing but memory loss. Memory loss is what you're gonna remember. Drago slams hard into his opponent. Sit down, you dirty sons of bitch. We went almost ten fucking rounds. Just to we went seven minutes just talking shit to each other. And made absolutely no sense. And that's what I call a family dispute. Alright. I don't usually take up uh, Donnie very much. All right, I'm gonna keep uh, keep this in mind. I took and disabled the rounds. The rounds are disabled, so it is gonna be a uh, back to back. Anything goes. This is round three out of five. Two on me, zero to you. Why are you so fucking short? I kind of feel bad beating a midget. <laughs> no. Midget? <laughs> Fucking thug life, bitch. Fucking thug life, motherfucker. <laughs> That's why you don't even appear in the story no more. That's why you were removed from the story mode. I was the only one that mattered to stay in campaign. You used to be so cool because you used to. I'd be everything because I still had Rocky Balboa going to suck these, these mittens. Damn it, he left me like my papa did. <laughs> I'm sorry, did you say something? Did you, did you hear something? I was having a hard time hearing you. <laughs> oh, that was nice. Very nice. <laughs> Very nice. Alright, let's get this down. <laughs> Just like that, Donnie. Hold the fuck. Where the fuck is that? Just like that, Donnie. Shut the fuck up. Where are you at, you old man? No homo. No homo, man. How do you think that... They are matching. They're both black. The fuck? Okay, so I guess I really am the gay one here. This is it. No holding back. Oh shit, I gotta win now. That's how you do it, Donnie. Fuck. You know what? Actually, my mom was a fucking whore anyway. Oh, she she slept with Apollo. Three. I don't love him either. Okay, you know what? That makes no sense. Just shut the fuck up now. Come on.
Damn, that hurt. Creed slams hard into his opponent. Rex, uh, fighting people like Rex, good flurry fighters like him. He's he's exhausting. He's exhausting trying to go and keep up with. That's what makes him so fun to play against. Is whether you like someone or not, you really don't have no change in the fact that their skill level, like his speed, is unbelievable, and that's what makes him so horrifying to fight. Five, six. All right, well you're doing just fine to me. Some people just naturally have the ability. Keep throwing punches like that, kid. Like I said, for the champ to say that you fight just like he used to, it's pretty much me saying you're just as good as I am. If you were to read behind the lines, that's pretty much what I told you, is you're as good as I am when we first met. However, when I said you used to be like me, is uh, me saying that, you know, you're my past self. You're untrained still. You are me before I got all the training and work I have into me now. Once you get that training, you'll be good. I mean, it's not so much the fact that, like, I'm throwing it like that. Because if you were to, like, if I was to slow down, this is actually what I'm throwing. Is I'm actually going and throwing it. And I'm throwing both hands in a single location, but my hands are being thrown by by side, and like they're thrown back to back without a re like a moment of repercussion. Is the best way I found to be able to go and really maximize speed. Since I'm quick, I've utilized like my slimmer, my uh, slim athletic uh, stature allows me to go and utilize heavy speed. You see, you see, the ability to block is uh, pretty useful, and that's how you've been able to hold me with some of those punches. Eh, not really. Not. I mean, it. You just gotta learn. You gotta learn how to block. It's just against you. The reason why you can't block against me is because you guard more toward the face, like that stance to hold them, right? Left right body I can still hit you any stance like that this stance that this it don't matter what you come out with I know how to do it the problem is is my reaction speed to that so as long as you're holding like this like when you're fighting and you start doing what uh, I recommended to try to keep something close to you like by fighting like this by the time you realized it by just holding this I'm already done I hit you twice and you don't even know what came and hit you. That's... You see, some of the problem with that as well, especially against me, is once you fight some of the faster opponents, like uh, some of those opponents that I've used to face, they were really quick, so I had to push my speed so when they're fighting they would really go and you don't even know what happened I think something you need to I mean I don't mind giving you I don't mind giving you a slower pace match in the slightest I mean like I said that was championship stuff I'm not losing my belt quite yet you did great all three rounds sure you didn't go and make the cut you never go and took a Neither one of you managed to take me down in all five rounds. No one had the chance to do nothing. And that's fine. Then again, though, what would a champ be if he wasn't tough to beat? It wouldn't be as rewarding to beat me for the belt if I wasn't tough to beat. It wouldn't have the spare if you beat some has-been nobody for the belt. Is that speed and reaction time I have that makes it hard for you to get nowhere with me? As I could read you much better. 
the problem, your biggest thing is I could read your ability, like I read you and what you're gonna do. So when I'm done doing what I'm gonna do is I keep pressured you and keeping you defense mainly. And then when I had a feeling you were gonna go into offense, that's when I backed into and backed off. That allowed me to recharge my hands and that allowed me to get a breath. So in that time, you're taken a wasting to gain energy back. What little bit I spent, it's back, it's gone. You ain't never even seen it go. No, it's just that's the uh, difference in the training. Like, once you go on, uh, if you were to watch, I might have some videos, but uh, some of the older people, I might be able to find uh, a v one of those videos of uh, Spartan and Chevy fighting. I want to say they have uh, quite a few up there on uh, of them fighting, and this is on PS4. And you'll see how good they're fighting and how traditional they are and like the ways they fight. And then you can kind of see where me and Rexy kind of learned because we're, we're underlings of those guys. And those guys tripled the scores we have now. Yeah. You see, until I need to, like, one of my biggest problems, and I'll even say this is a problem for me, is, uh, one of my biggest things is I haven't needed to duck and weave yet. I've had no reason to duck and weave as of late, so I'm spending less energy doing so. Because here's the thing, because no one's challenged me in that manner, I don't need to duck and weave. Now, you're exhausted. <laughs> That too. Oh, uh, no, not a problem, man. Hey, look, you did a great job for your first fight night. You made it to... The, you beat one of the former champs. You beat him. Sure, he's former champ. He's only two-time champ compared to what... I think this is... I mean, you beat one of the best. You can see why he's one of the better ones we had. Because his speed is ridiculous. I don't need to... I don't need to whip out that speed on you. I haven't had a reason to whip out my flurry speed on you. I don't think you want to see how fast I could throw hands. I've another time in ring where you could get staggered. Like the next time we fight, I'll throw it. All right, I will throw my speed at you. I'm only gonna throw 60% of how fast I could go the next time we find each other, and you will see what I mean. You will see what I mean by the fact that I'm quick. You will understand. <laughs> No worries. Peace out, man. Good games. Rexy sends his regards. Good games to you, too, he says. Oh, man. It'll be up there. It'll be premiered in around 4 p.m. About 4 p.m. is when it's going to be up there. About your time. That or 5. One of the two. Depends on how fast YouTube wants to do it. But good game, man. Better luck next week. Train harder. You will win. Just keep training. Keep working. And you'll get it. Take care. All right, guys, that will wrap. Oh, shit, hold on. Yeah, like I was saying, that wraps up this week's fight night. Like, hot damn. That is going to annoy me. How did I get team ranked? I'm going to work on that for a minute. But that is fight night for the week. We had two of the greatest challengers I've ever seen go in for the belt. Both of them could not even come close this week, but that is fine. Both of those two came out swinging and gave it their all. So with that being said, that was an impressive. Now, unlike that, I myself am not done here. I don't, I'm not going to end stream quite yet. I want my score back. I want my shit back. I did not do all my work to be like this. No, this, this right here, you guys are going to see exactly why... PS4 players are the most horrifying to find because now not only do I got to beat 560 on that board I now got to go and beat my old score because I'm not going to go and accept it until I beat my old score which yeah I'm going to go and uh, I'm going to be shooting for 700 now I want my thing to go and be unbeatable I want to go and outdo this you're going to see the drive these old players like myself have and you're going to see exactly why. When I say us old players are 
horrific, you're going to see exactly what drives us. Like, the will to do better is what keeps us going. That's what keeps us deadly. Now, I'm probably going to be, uh, for the most part, I'm going to not really talk too much. I'm going to probably just pop my earbuds in, let the music go, and I'm going to just stand here. And I'm going to top my score. If I fail, I'll come back and I'm going to keep going. I refuse to just lose. I cannot just lose. So, I am going to need to find my phone real quick. I know it's somewhere around here. That is not a bed, Meals. That's my computer you're laying on. Bitch. How about that? There it is. Alright, I see it. I think to hold that I had about 20 minutes or something like that. Hmm, let's see what I can do. That would be a good, uh...
Oh, that's bullshit. I'll say you better not shoot me that time. What the hell, man?
No, you don't. Fuck it. That ain't right, man. That ain't right.